Okay guys, so I'm going to do a quick video of some of the Magnus sliders that if you had a question on how to replace the magnets or if you were like me, you pulled um, one of the covers off, one of the frames off to see what's underneath and the magnets go flying everywhere and then you are trying to put them back in and you have no idea how to put it back in and uh, you're spinning your wheels and then you start asking questions on Facebook and tons of answers out there. Some people like to say put it on a baking sheet where it's metal underneath and then you can put them in that way. Honestly, the easiest way is to just magnetize it to the plate that already has the magnets in it. So I've already pulled out the screws on this one, um, but I'm going to attach it to the bottom plate to show you. When you pull off the frame, there's your eight magnets, all right? And basically you just take your stack, you know, just like this, and you just put them each in and they will stay because they're magnetized to the plate below. Um, I've updated each corner magnet on both sides to the N52 stronger magnets. I think they come with N45. So it's just a little stronger, but basically that's the simplest way to put your magnets in. You have it magnetized to the plate underneath. They stick nice and easy. You put your frame back on, make sure it's tight, and then you slide it out from underneath, and there's your frame. And then you put your screws back in. I'll put one in just to, just for show. Now, let's see here. There we go. Ah. There's sometimes a pain. Okay, so there you go. Now it's together. And easy as pie. So if you ever do pull out your screws and take the frame off, make sure that you have it magnetized to something else so that your screws don't go flying everywhere. Uh, or I'm sorry, that your magnets don't go flying everywhere. And again, very, very simple. Just attach it to a magnetized plate. You have your screws out, you pull your frame off, boom, you've got your magnets. Very, very simple. And then you put it back together. Make sure that you hold it nice and tight with your fingers because the magnets will try to push the plate off and put each screw in. And you might want to put a drop of Loctite in those screws to keep them in. It's completely up to you. Some people have issues with them um, spinning out on their own. So it's completely up to you. But anyways, that is how you replace or change out your magnets with any one of the magnet sliders that has the screws and the plates, which they all do. So um, I know I, I didn't go through it completely, but again, it's super simple. So if you have any questions, let me know. All right, bye-bye.